Welcome, welcome back. Oh, uh, I'm Mary Jane Blank, and uh, I'm re returning you to where I left off in Gish. Whoa. She, how, okay, how come she can't jump, but she can fucking control herself in the air? What? I guess that makes sense. Those are not, those are m not mutually exclusive, technically, I suppose. I was gonna say she's pushy, but then again, this whole thing is her trying to force me to marry her. This, uh, paint, this, what is it called? Deborah? Deborah! The name Deborah has forever been ruined. So many names, forever ruined. Although some are common enough. It's just common, not even like. You know, basically, only uncommon names can be ruined. Essentially. I mean, all the Josephs of the world can attest to that. But the Adolphs of the world probably cannot. Very few of those. But Josephs? You're probably gonna find Josephs all over the fucking place. Absolutely. <laughs> oh yeah, I don't know why I'm doing it this way. So. No one told you Michael was going to be this way. Shit. I hate how well she can control herself in the air. Like, so she's heavier than me? Debra! Debra! But it, like, and it... Yeah, it is what it is. It is just like using a life without losing a life. It's weird because none of the other bosses, like nothing else works like that in this game. So like, I don't know why the ending is being sort of generous here. This doesn't seem like a generous kind of game. This seems like an unforgiving game, personally. Or at least it seems like it's meant to be unforgiving. I guess it's not unforgiving. That's true. That's actually a good point. Because there is an easy mode, so the game is not unforgiving. Uh, you know, there are games that are not... You know, it's hard to say that. That's a weird term to apply to a game, but, like, punishing. Like, this game is not intentionally punishing, I don't think. You know? I think it's basically just, like, an uh, every old platformer. You know what I mean? Like, uh... This, as this is an indie game of the 2000s, this would have been a, gen, you know, a Sega Genesis game. With, like, a... just a more prominent pro pro uh, property attached. Or a Super nin Nintendo. I mean, obviously the graphics would be totally different, they'd be a lot worse, but... Um... But, yeah, but essent the essentials are the same. And obviously there'd be different dialogue, too. It wouldn't be better, it would just be different. Because all, like, corporate corporations care about <laughs> care about mass appeal. Sorry, that was weird noise. Um, yeah, it's really interesting, too, how, yeah, Disney has kind of taken over. That's sort of the other thing that, like, it's really killing it for me, is, like, it's hard to love things... Get out of here. That Disney buys. Once Disney buys it, it's like, oh, Disney is going to try to get all of my money, To ex is going to try to exploit my love for this thing for the rest of my life to get my money. Which will just allow them to, to do this more. It's so fucked. Um, yeah, no, that's why I'm not really, I don't really care for the Marvel Cinematic Universe. And it's not even that, the movies are fine. It's not even that I don't like them. It's that, uh, but it's that, like, I can't get invested in seeing them for that, that reason. Same thing with kind of Star Wars, like, I only saw one of the three 
new Star Wars in theaters. Hell, there's a lot of things. Like, basically, once once I got old enough to realize that they try to sell your nostalgia back to you um, in very weird ways, and some in very interesting ways. Sometimes they sell your nostalgia to your kids, which is very interesting, clearly. Like, clearly the She-Ra show is made for... Uh, not made for the reactionaries of... You know, men who grew up in the 80s who the original um, He-Man was made for, which is so weird that they comment on She-Ra as though it was, like, some big part of their childhoods when usually it's these assholes from the 90s. I don't know. There's a lot of dudes who piss me off online. Uh, a lot of people who piss me off online. Um, but it's interesting. It's interesting. Oh, God. The, the sort of reasoning behind that is sort of interesting. Okay. Okay. As long as it gets up there, that's all. That's what I really want. I just want it to get up there. Get up there! There we go. I did it. I did it for once. No! I'm gonna die again. I'm gonna get eat at. I'm gonna get at. I'm gonna get at up. That's what's gonna happen to me. Uh oh, she's moving. She's moving. All right, now I'm safe. So it's all good. I just have to. Be careful how I fling it. Hell yeah. Oh, I got it! Uh-oh, SpaghettiOs. Sorry, friend. Sorry, bad friend. Time to die. Uh-oh, not me, though. I survived. Yay! All right, now I just release her and she dies. Oh my god! Whoa, crazy! <laughs> Cool. Girlfriend rescuing bonus. One. <laughs> Love it. Love it so much. You don't have to rescue her? God, this game sucks. I hate this. Alright, ending, I guess. That noise, again, this is a Sega Genesis game. That That is reminiscent of Sega Genesis, specifically. After rescuing Brea... Brea! From the clutches of that obsessed psycho Hera, Gish and Brea went on to become world-renowned entomologists and had the world's first legal interspecies marriage. I fucking knew it. Hera was never heard from again, although some say they can hear her calling Gish's name from the depths of Gehenna. Sadly, to this day, no one seems to remember who she was. Congratulations. Thanks for playing, Gish. Cool. I did it. Now this picture I like. Back. Great. Well. Alright. Well, thank you for watching. I am completely empty. Uh, I have nothing to say. Like, share, subscribe, comment. If you are... Uh, oh, here we go. Here's the credits. la da yada Credits. Alright, so yeah. Like, comment, subscribe. Um... Examples of comments you can leave. Smoke weed every day, 420. Um, stop playing video games. I hate gamers and video games. Um, Kirby rules, Mario drools, Sonic rules, Kirby drools, uh, Banjo rules, Sonic drools, uh, etc., etc., and so on and so forth. Um... I have no clue what else to say. Uh, if you enjoyed this, buy the game, I guess. Have have a good night. I'm gonna. I'm done.